Well, there, I'm sure if you were intimate in their organization, you'd probably find out there's a lot of things that are happening. I mean, George has been, uh, you're going through radiation. It's been really tough. There, uh, you know, it's just a loss of personality and, and energy that goes into the team, probably. And the seasons are long, uh, as you guys know. They're, they're long, they're wearing teams. And, um, you know, we still expect a real tough game there. There's no, no let up in Denver. I know you've known George for a long time. Have you uh, talked to him at all to, you know, to try and encourage him at this tough part of his life? Well, George isn't talking to anybody right now. His wife is, you know, posting some things on the Daily Post that keeps people informed as to how he's doing. Um, his last radiation treatment was last week. And hopefully, he's going to recover here. Uh, there's possibility he may miss the first round. Is what they said. How Are difficult you... is what Dantley's going through trying to like kind of fill in? The... Well, that's an opportunity. It may be difficult, but that's a great opportunity. And you know, I'm sure he looks for it, uh, looks at it like that too, to be able to sit there and you know, make some decisions and have an opportunity to do some things out there. And, um, you know, there's some pressure, but you know, that's what you, uh, you get used to. That that's what you do. When you've missed some games over the years, there's way less minor things than what Carl's going through. Are you in, you know, when Clem steps up or Kurt steps up? Are you in their ear when they take over, or you just give them like the rain? You know, I never, I never missed a game. I, uh, four or five, six, seven years ago, I had an um, allergic reaction to a procedure that I had uh, that made me miss a playoff game. And, you know, Clem stepped up and it was his team. And then last year, I uh, sat out a Portland trip because of uh, some swelling that I, I had going on in my leg. So those are the only two games I've missed in those 1,000, 1,300 games. So, you know, I, I had an opportunity when I was an assistant coach because my coach was a volatile coach. Devin Lockery got thrown out 14 times in the course of the year. So you, know, you get a game, three quarters, a half, a quarter, five minutes left in the game, 25 seconds left in the game, whatever. But um, coaches aren't quite as demonstrative in this day and age. And uh, well, there are some that still get thrown out, but it's not quite the same.